we're making this video today to show you how to operate a forklift and move pallets without having a pallet in what we call bail pack. So the forklift driver is entering the trailer. The units are bail packed, so he is going to do the same procedure in the trailer as you would on the warehouse by tipping the forks forward, sliding under the first unit. You go about halfway, give or take, to where you can pick up the unit safely without tipping it forward. You lower your forks all the way to the bottom. It's almost like you're flipping an egg with a spatula. Back up as you come out of the trailer and slow down as you come over the dock plate because the bump can cause them to tip forward if you don't have a good enough bite. And as you back out of the trailer, as you can see, he pulls forward, does the same concept, tips the forks forward so the edge of the unit sits on the concrete, backs out just like you're sliding a spatula out from beneath an egg. And then you slide back in just about four or five inches, pick up the unit and you can push it forward to eliminate the gap between units. This is our forklift operator demonstrating how to pick up a single unit and apply it to a pallet for customers that might need to move a unit with a pallet jack or a forklift and require them in a pallet racking system. This will be showing you how to put the unit on the pallet as well as taking it off if you ever needed to take it off. This is important so if a customer has a pallet racking system that might require a unit to be stored in a racking system up above, usually it needs to be on a pallet. It's not safe to store it in a bail pack. So this is where you would pull the unit off, put it on a pallet, so those customers that require that can put it in a system in a rack. Or if you were to move product around a warehouse and you only had a pallet jack, you could use this technique so you have the units on a pallet. By using bail pack, you eliminate the debris from the broken pallets. It's load and go. Our customers are always number one. They're the ones that we're always looking out for. And by doing this, we're hopefully making their life easier. And this is just one way we've done it at Packaging Corporation of America.